Good day, friends. It is me, HL Mod Tech, and I'm back with another Glowforge tutorial. Today, my friends, we're going to use Laser Bond 100, and we're going to make ourselves a sweet bottle opener. So let's get cracking. All right, so step one was to buy Laser Bond 100, which I got a can of this. The instructions are pretty simple. Shake it for 60 seconds, which I've already been doing because I'm not going to show you that on screen. And then all you do is spray a thin coat six to ten inches away and let that dry for a few minutes and you're ready to put it in the Glowforge. All right, so these are the blanks that I bought on Amazon. Six of them only cost about nine dollars. Uh, that ends up being a buck fifty plus the spray uh, per bottle opener, which is a pretty decent deal. And now, my friends, let's use the premium tools to put a sweet design and logo on the opener. Alrighty, friends, so here is our part in the Globe Forge. I'm using my little guide alliance so that I can reuse this if I ever want. Let's try and do the entire part using the premium trial. So I'm going to put the phrase get cracking and I want to find an image that kind of signifies cracking. Now that is a little nervous to type in. You just don't know what you're going to find, but let's see if we can find something that does work for me. I think I like this broken image where it's got a stick that looks like it's busted by a fist. All right, let's zoom back out and see where that landed. There it is, and I'm going to turn on my 250 speed, 100 power, 75 lines per centimeter, uh, 4 millimeter settings, although I'm going to adjust them uh, to 3 millimeters because that's how thick this stainless steel is. I'm going to grab this design, and I'm going to pull it into the area. Notice it separates, so I'm going to undo that. I'm going to make sure I've got all the parts selected and let's do that one more time so it moves as a group. I'm going to shrink it, get it placed right where I want. I think I'm going to like that. Notice, even though you can select one piece at a time, it will still all have the exact same setting. Let's go over to the text option and let's put our words in. We're going to put get cracking. Remember when you type your words, like I want get to be all capitals, so I'm going to type it in all capitals. And then I'm going to move it over here as one big group. I'm going to keep the proportions turned on and rotate that a little bit. And then I'm going to add a second piece of text with the same font. And this is where I'm going to say Kraken. And don't forget to press enter so that it locks it in place move that over and now start adjust until everything looks the way I want you can shut off the proportions if you want to adjust the way they all fit I'm also gonna turn on the settings so that they are easier to see I'm gonna do the exact same thing uh, where I switch it to three millimeters and I switch it to three millimeters And then I can shrink and adjust and get it just the way I want. That's going to be pretty sharp. I am going to grab this little piece right here and I'm just going to make it a tiny bit smaller and put it right there. That, my friends, is going to be the get cracking bottle opener so without any further ado let's set that material uh, remember this will be one where we do the material height I'm gonna tell it three millimeters thick it'll refocus that still looks great I'm gonna just nudge it a hair to the right though and and my friends let's send it to the Glowforge and make something awesome all right best part ever magic button time
All right, so after just those few minutes, let's take it in and rinse it off in the sink and see what we made. All righty, friends, so simple water cleanup. And your design is permanently in place. How cool is that? Alrighty friends, so there you have it. That is how easy it is to make a sweet bottle opener using Laser Bond 100 and the Globeforge. Friends, if you enjoyed the video, please give it a like. If you got a question, comment, or a suggestion, add it down below. If you haven't subscribed yet, what are you waiting for? Smash that subscribe button, and last but not least, hit that notification bell if you want to be the first to know when there's a brand new video from me, HL Mod Tech. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.